Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do your 72 hour energy reading. This is a love reading, so it will, um, the basis is love. Uh, it could resonate with you, it could not. I hope that it does. If it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Thank you to those who already do. Uh, I took the liberty of, go, of pulling the cards off camera. And also, I separated the reading into Gemini singles, couples. We'll start with couples, all right? So let's get into it. We got the two of hearts at the bottom of the deck. So that's very nice. Maybe a successful union, a successful uh, connection, a successful relationship, mutually beneficial. Uh, it's hand in hand. It's uh, the exchange. Um, the ebb and flow it, it, it marries each other perfectly okay you and someone else could be cancer pisces scorpio doesn't have to be ten of hearts wow five of clubs so you know what this says in the playing cut playing cards deck of course the ten of hearts is the highest level of happiness either you have a family with this person or you want a family with them they make you extremely happy new love new friendship new marriage is the five of clubs um the fives govern the hierophant and the tarot hierophant governs traditionalism organization unity so this is very good for my uh gemini couples you're having some really good energy could be dealing with an aries sagittarius leo cancer pisces scorpio let's see what the shells have to say oh uh, the Okay, uh, this one says run, leave. Maybe you need to leave uh, an old connection behind. Let's see what this is about. Friends, okay. Leave that. what the friends say. Maybe you have single friends. They're playing a part in this. They're, this the fives are about change and divide also. So maybe there's a bit of division here in regards to your heart. You know how you feel about this particular person and the relationship is going well. But your friends are playing a part here or they have played a part here business you may have a business here um you need to divide your time amongst the relationship and the business uh this person could help you with business they have their own business job uh, maybe you've given them a job maybe they need to get a job something about a job here um financial abundance money is abundant says material and emotional needs are met here the highest level of happiness uh, drama i really feel like it's an outside source the fives also talk about interference so it might be in an air of uh interference in regards to this is a really good connection or it was a really good connection but friends outside interference um a job a business interfered and maybe you guys going the distance here uh, or going the distance okay let's get some advice here meditation brings answers okay so you may be confused about what to do next how to resolve or dissolve friendship a relationship or, or just re put put some resolve here um so that's good it's still good uh it just needs to be balanced okay all right so for my gemini singles we have at the bottom of the deck the seven of wands so you could be defending yourself could be defending a relationship a marriage some contract or someone could be defensive in regards to all of those things how you could be coming off to others is defensive is um maybe having many suitors or someone you're dealing with has many suitors um it's just an element of um, opposition also you know opposing thought your, your, your psychic abilities are heightened also you're going to have success and prosperity because of something you're doing you're consistently uh, plowing at doing something uh, and you'll see the manifestation of that okay uh, the moon Ten of Cups again. Wow. The Ten of Cups for the couples. Ten of Cups for the singles. So, there may be something you're not admitting to yourself. 
maybe in regards to how you feel about a particular person, place, or thing. That, that they make you very happy, that you want a family with them, that you want your family back. There may be an element of maybe someone, you guys are polar opposite, but you still want the same thing. You go about life differently. So the, the idea here or the catch is um, how to marry the two energies so that you guys can be together in happiness, in bliss. But still be yourselves, still are different. Someone I'm hearing stop trying to change me. Someone wanted someone to change or something to change. There's also there was like something hidden here, an element of um uh, maybe about this person, place or thing, but this is love, so this is a person that was hidden. You also felt like this could be a a mother, this could have been where you guys cycled in and out of each other's lives. This could be motherly energy. Like you, you could want to fight for this connection eventually. Let's see what the shell said. Love. Like you you may not be admitting to yourself that you love this person. And you want to be with them. Wow, family, that you want a family with them. That there's some spiritual connection here. We talked about psychic abilities being heightened. That maybe you can understand or you feel, you can feel them energetically even when they're not around. That maybe you think about them at night. You dream about them. There is a connection here. Uh, marriage. Wow. That you want marriage with this person. Um, divorce also. Maybe you have to divorce the idea that this person isn't changing so however they are you have to accept them um you also could my gemini singles you could be fighting for the connection fighting for the marriage fighting for the family um then there's the element of divorce someone wanting to divorce a year from now things may look very different okay so that's what i have for you gemini it's still very good reading. Gemini has been having really good energy lately, which is great. The The tides are turning. Everything is shifting. So that is really, really good. Um, if you feel like this reading resonated with you for you, go over to the website. Book your reading there. Take advantage of the 72-hour energy reading. Um, I pull cards for your energy for career and finance, love and romance. You cannot ask questions. That's the only thing about that reading. I just pull cards for you, okay? Um, if you feel like you need to ask questions, book another reading or take advantage of the 30 minute phone reading that is on sale where you can ask questions um, and get me on the phone. All right. So Gemini, know that I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys.